Hello everyone, it's Jazzy34 here. I'm here with another anime haul. And first I'm just going to show off this one little item that I got off of AmiAmi that I got some more Toho straps. Now of course I got, I wanted to get the Pacholi one so I can go and fill up that extra little space in my either bag so I can get that completed. And also it is the, the, other, the other characters to go along with it as well. So I'm just going to open this up and see which one I get first. And I probably won't open up the rest of them, I'll just <coughs> open them up later. But I do want to... See which one I get. Hopefully, I do get Pachi on the first try. Mm -mm. Let's see open there. Let's see who I got first. Ah, oh, I got Yuka. That's so cute. Oh, I just really like this little style. And this is the Spell of Pacholi version, this one, which is really nice. So yeah, I'll open the other ones up a little later. That way I can get Pachi. That way I can complete my either bag. Now, of course, I went to. Mandarake and I went really just a little crazy with certain stuff that I got. I just got some stuff. Of course, speaking of Toll, I decided to get this from Mandarake. It was a really nice little cheeky she little <coughs> autograph, little autograph like sketch card or I think it's like a sketch card or something like that, like a little autograph board. Yeah, like a little board. <laughs> that looks so cute. I just really like this design. <laughs> Such a huge Pachi fan. And also, I wanted to create that. I got some Dojin cheese as well, and of course, these are like 18 plus, so uh, <laughs> as much as I can show right here, it's one of them I got from the Token Ranbu series, so I got these two right here. Also, I got another Dojin cheese with Pacholi there, and that's also 18 plus, so I can't really show the back. And also, I got this other one, which I can't really exactly show you, but that's also 18 plus as well, so yeah, it was a nice little Dojin cheese I wanted to pick up as well. And also, from Andorake, these. I got a bit separately. I got two figures. One I got from for a separate package, and this one I got from, along with the other ones I got with the dojinshis and the um, and the board. So this one I got from Aya, and this, she's from the Toho Ten series. And I just really like how this is designed, and especially from the artwork on the side of the box that just looks so pretty. Now as I was looking at the bottom here, I was wondering how she's going to stand up with these, with these there. So I guess the base must have something for the stick these on so hopefully it doesn't tilt over so that looks really cute I want to see how big it looks there we go they had to really put some force in it to put it on her body there but that looks so pretty it's really like how this figure looks it's like one of my favorite prize figures that I own right next to the fake figure that I have I just really like the style of the wings that just looks so pretty. Hopefully I have some room at the bottom of my shelf. I do kind of notice there is like a little it's just I'm not sure if it's probably meant to be there to kind of make it the kind of contrast with the shading or something like that. Maybe it might be a painting area but it still looks pretty nice. Oh yeah it's probably a little bit more at the top there but yeah I like that shading as well. Yeah, it's like a little almost like a like a forest green type of hue there with the black. This does a nice little, nice little touch there. She has a little, <laughs> little maple leaves there. And of course, we're going to finish off with the last figure. Of course, I decided to pick this up because I saw this on somebody else's channel. I wanted to get this too. It just looks so pretty. I just had to get another Sonico figure. I just want to see how that looks up close. Now, of course, this is much. I think it's about the same size as my um. Same size as the either figure, but it's definitely a little heavier. Of course, I don't have any scissors, so I gotta rely on my human strength. strength doesn't rip the box. <laughs> These are a nice little small little base there. That's really nice. It's really convenient for me. That way I can have some room on my shelf for it. That just looks so precious. Oh, it's really like the little designs on it. Just a nice little color scheme with the blues and the purples and the pinks. Oh my god. <laughs> that is so cute. That's a nice little Sony Co face because usually some of the Sony Co figures don't really have really like like attractive faces to them. 
But this one, it, this one looks really perfect on there. It's really matching with the outfit too. I mean, it definitely has to match. Hmm. Unfortunately, it does have a little, little pink splash there, a little pink mistake there, a little blue there, but you know, I'm not going to worry too much about that. <laughs> Let me just easily put that together there. It just looks so pretty. I just really love this figure. It was a nice, another nice figure to go into my collection. So I'm just really happy I got this. I was really just exploring my mind directly. I got some really cool stuff. And I hope you really like this haul video that I have. And everyone, have a nice day.